welcome to the Color Art Summer Splash event. Today, I hope to inspire you to explore the world of fluid art. Now, I'm a simple girl and I don't care for complicated recipes, which I guess is kind of why I like color art. It takes all the complication out of this. And let's just talk about my base paint, or my base coat, if you will. My base is just your standard acrylic paint, nothing too complicated, mixed with my pouring medium to the consistency that I desire in order to create this. Then I'm gonna use an alternative color and I'm gonna swipe that over. I don't use paper towels. I don't like paper towels uh, because I find it catches the paint and absorbs too much of it and I don't get a consistent effect over the canvas. I actually use a plastic file divider. I find that when I put the plastic file divider down, I can actually, because it's transparent, I can see the color to make sure that it's picking it up consistently as I pull it across to form my base coat. Then I'm gonna take my swipe over color. I'm going to put a small little puddle. I'm gonna blow that out to expose the base paint color and form the outer petal of the flower. And then I'm going to, as you just saw, puddle layer all of my colors topped with a cell activator, which again is tube paint mixed with Australian Floetrol, and I'm gonna blow out what I guess you would call the flower pistol to use the anatomy of a flower, which is now called the Awesome Blossom Technique. For the moment, I'm just gonna turn up the music. I'm gonna let you sit back and kind of absorb everything I just told you and watch me blow out these little flowers. And then I'm gonna come back and explain a little bit more of how you can win some fabulous prizes in today's Summer Splash event, and a little bit more about my mixing of paints and how I created this. So just sit back, relax, drink a cup of coffee, have a glass of wine, your choice, and I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, so now I'm gonna make some little awesome blossom skins. Eventually you're gonna see this whole thing come together. But let's just talk about the color art and how I create the little pistol in the middle. So the colors that I used, I'll list in the description below, but the first color that I laid down was a primary element pigment. And that's pretty simple. Like I didn't really realize, I guess, how simple pigments were to use, but I take a little scoop, I put it in my little silicone mixing cup, and I use the acrylic medium that comes with the Color Art pigment product, which is really, really handy, to the right consistency. And that was the first color that you saw me lay down. The additional colors on top of that are all prism pour. Again, super easy. I take a squirt, I put it in my little silicone cup. I used, in this case, Jasana varnish, and I just, you know, squeezed that in there, stirred it up to the right consistency, and it was kind of done. It was really, really simple. And now I'm going to cut out the skins. 24 hours roughly have passed. And I'm gonna cut out the skins because you're gonna see eventually what I'm gonna do with that. So again, I'll be back in a little bit because this is a very long process and we are only five minutes into a, I don't know, 14, 15 minute video. Tiffany, enough already. Tell me about the prizes. Okay, here's what you have to do. 
watch all the videos from today's lineup of Color Art Affiliates. Oh yeah, did I mention? I'm now a Color Art Affiliate too. That's right, my coupon code is in the description below uh, and you can use it to get 20% off all your Color Art purchases. How cool is that? Okay, back to how to win. Watch all of the videos, collect the secret words, create the phrase, email that to Leslie over at Color Art and there'll be instructions below and then you can enter for a chance to win $400 worth of Color Art product. <laughs> Pretty awesome, huh? But that's not it. On top of that, if you like and subscribe to each video of all the Color Art affiliates today, you can enter uh, for each channel to win a small prison pour set. And so that's what, 14 chances to win plus the grand prize? So that's actually 15 chances to win some color art stuff. Pretty awesome. So you're gonna have to keep watching though to get my secret word to create your phrase. So I'll be back. I hope that you enjoyed that. That was probably, oh, 
eight or nine hours of video footage that had to be condensed into a very short time frame because now I actually make skins. Yeah. Hmm. I warned you in a previous video that we were just getting started. So I took the original concept of my Blossom bouquet and now we've taken it up a notch. If you've never been to my channel before, um, I do this. <laughs> Whatever this is, the, now we're calling it the Awesome Blossom. So she doesn't have a name. If you'd like to name her, please leave that in the comments below. I'd be happy to hear your ideas. And let's be honest, if you want to win the uh, little set of Prison Pour Paints, you're going to have to comment anyway. A few things that I'd like to mention though, the Awesome Blossom itself, that is all color art. The initial petal outline, that is my tube paint. If you want to know the colors that I use because you like them, you can go down in the description below. All the colors will be listed in the order that I place them. You can also use my affiliate code uh, when you visit the color art site and you can order these paints and many other colors. It's overwhelming how many colors there are with my discount code. Not only did I use the color art to make the flower pistol, I also used one of those colors to do the lip and I also used one of those colors to do the top of her dress. In the little blossom, I used a color called French Silk. I went over the dress with the French Silk in order to give it a iridescent shimmer. So let me take you in for a close up of the Awesome Blossom because they are really awesome. I love them. So you can see a little bit of the shimmer. I don't know if I can turn, oh, flash on. Okay, here we go. So you can see this is very iridescent, um, her dress as opposed to the flat opaqueness of her skin, right? You see the difference? Yeah, big difference, right? And that's because I used the Color Art French Silk just over top of the dress, yeah. And then here is her lip, again, the shimmer of her lip, and that's because I used, here's something interesting, I actually used all the colors that make up the Awesome Blossom are actually all floral colors from Color Art, which I thought was kind of serendipitous, but anyway, back to the test at hand. Um, so again, you can see the shimmer on the lip because I used the pink carnation. And then here is the awesome blossom. I'm gonna try to get out of this glare. I don't know. Let's see how we do here. So there's the awesome blossom. I think it's absolutely fantastic. Here's another one. Like I can't get over what I was able to achieve utilizing, using prison pour and the primary elements. Yeah, it's like just amazing. So I hope that you enjoyed that. I hope you enjoyed watching me create this. Um, for some of you, this will be the very first time that you've ever been to my channel. And I hope that you'll like, subscribe, turn on notifications and come back um, so you can see how I take this awesome blossom another level up. I don't know what that means yet, but we're gonna give it a shot. So down in the description below, I've got the next artist coming up. Follow us all over there because you need the secret word because you gotta put that together. Plus you're gonna have to like and subscribe to their channel as well to win the prize that each one of us are giving away on our channel. Again, more information down below and I will see you in the next video.